Hi, my name is uh, Mame slater Enns, and I am one of the presenters of the Care For You conference. I did a session on live, love, laugh, activities that you can do with your family members. Um, I, I really talked about four uh, very specific things that you can do as a family member, but the first thing I did in my session was I, I tried to provide information that you could use as family members. I talked about the persisting assets of those people who are uh, living with Alzheimer's disease and um, the, the strengths, the capabilities, uh, and um, uh, assets that they carry on, they carry with them through their journey with the Alzheimer's disease. The next thing that I provided um, was uh, just providing techniques, the kind of techniques that you would need to use um, as uh, you work with your family member or friend as they are experiencing dementia. And some of these techniques are um, you know, how you cue them and so you, you stimulate long-term memory, the use of sensory stimulation, um, the use of touch uh, and, and a smell to bring back those really positive memories, but also to uh, bring activities that are age-appropriate um, and uh, even though you might be reading a child's story uh, to stimulate some of those memories that they might have reading to their children, but to make it adult-like so that they feel um, that they're still an adult, that you're not bringing those activities down to a childlike um, activity that they might feel devalued. The other thing I talked about is about valuing sort of their past life experience and how we can do that through uh, uh, making uh, you know, their rooms, if, if they're moving into a personal care home, uh, putting up some of those, let's say if they're a, a war hero, putting up medals up on the wall or telling their story uh, so that the staff that are working with these individuals or with your family member know your family member and know sort of the extent of their life experience and, and the richness of the life that they've lived. Um, and lastly, um, in my presentation, um, I just talked about some of those activities that you can do with your family members. Uh, and how to create those environments, um, uh, and create an environment that uh, uh, would stimulate memory uh, as they move from their home into a personal care home. Um, I've put my PowerPoint, uh, or Alzheimer's Society is putting my PowerPoint on their website, so please have a look at that. Um, it has a lot of information. Uh, I've used two, I've used one author in particular, Carol Bowlby Sifton. She's amazing and has been a real inspiration, and she's written two books, which is which are listed at the end of the PowerPoint. And I highly encourage you to, um, you know, if you can get them out in the library, I know Red River has um, the persisting assets, or Alzheimer's disease and persisting assets. Uh, that's not quite the right name, but uh, they do have access to that book at the Red River College. You might want to have a look at that one as well. So thank you very much.